we're excited about this one. It's a favorite, but done differently. We're starting with half a cup of melted butter, supposed to be softened, I overdid it. That's okay, we're doing creamy peanut butter next. Yum. One cup, whoops, let me use a different one. That's a lot of peanut butter. Wonder who's gonna taste this one? I don't know. <laughs> I'll probably have to. <laughs> you, you might. I'm typically not a chocolate peanut butter person. I just gave something away. Uh oh. But we'll get there. We're gonna mix this up first. Next is one teaspoon of vanilla. Oh, I didn't go over this time. Good job. <laughs> Well, thank you. And we'll mix that in. That looks pretty good. Now we're going to start adding some powdered sugar. It's two and a half cups, but we're gonna do a little bit at a time. Okay. So we'll do some of this and start mixing on low. All right, I think that's good enough. We are gonna find out though. So next we have a square baking dish lined with parchment paper. And we're gonna transfer all of this into there. So it just became like a big piece of dough, huh? It did. Smells good. Oh yeah, it does. <laughs> Can you smell the peanut butter? Mm-hmm. It's sticky. It is. Just like peanut butter. <laughs> now we're just going to start pressing it into our dish and trying to get into the corners as best we can. You said you, you wet, wet your hand oh, yeah. the first time. I did. And actually, I probably could have added some more powdered sugar, which would have made it a little drier and easier to work with. Oh, I didn't. So here we are. Okay. Well, this will work. We'll get it there. Alrighty, that looks good. Much better better than it started. Next are my favorite mm. chocolate chips. And we're gonna measure out two cups worth. One down, one to go. That's right. Looks like there's a couple extra for me. <laughs> And we're gonna take this to the microwave, but I have to tell you the recipe called for, let me see, two tablespoons of coconut oil being optional. It will make the chocolate shiny. I did not do that or buy it because it was extremely expensive and I wasn't doing it. So it won't be shiny, but that's okay. All right. This is gonna go in the microwave. We'll start with 30 seconds at a time. We just wanna get it nice and melted. Alrighty, that looks pretty good. It looks really good, actually. It does look good. <laughs> that makes me very happy. <laughs> all right, all we're gonna do <clears throat> is start spreading. I'm saving this spoon. Yes, I am saving. Uh oh, she's mm -hmm. saving the spoon. I mean, I should be able to, right? What if I reach over and grab it right now? Oh, ah, uh, you might be in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Again. Would Would you? I would not even think about it. I know, you're too smart for that. <laughs> That's why we've been married so long. <laughs> That's right. I am making a mess with it. Is it really considered a mess when it's chocolate? I don't think so. I don't know. We're gonna spread it around, get it nice and even. All, All right. right, here it is. Now we're gonna take it to the fridge for about two hours to let the chocolate harden. All right. All right, let's give this a try. Move this over here. It lifted right out, huh? Look at that beautiful chocolate. Mm -hmm. And a layer of peanut butter under there. Mm -hmm. Let's see if I can get, I better get a smaller bite. <laughs> Ooh, it broke. Okay. okay. Let's see, That because the chocolate's hard. Oh. Well, I guess I'm taking a bite. <laughs> Let me You're see. just gonna take a whole chunk of that. Yeah. And, yeah. I, and I'm not, you know. You're not sad about it either. I'm not at all. <laughs> I'm going in. Mm. Oh, it's a little hard. Yeah. Mm. What do you think? Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Ooh, I have to try this. I love peanut butter mm. and chocolate together. Mm. Good. Don't mind me. I need a minute. Okay. Mm. We'll just wait. Mm-hmm. Okay, time's up. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so it's good. It's very good. Good. And definitely you will want a glass of milk. Yeah. With it, I will have water. But, oh my. Mm-hmm. Great. Very good. Definitely a keeper. Good um, deal. Like we said, it's a switch on a classic, mm-hmm. the Buckeyes. So you can roll them like normal or do it like this. So yeah, that's great. We highly recommend. Good. Or I, you haven't tasted it. I highly uh-huh. recommend. Oh, I bet I will too. Mm. Very good. Okay. So here they are, no bake Buckeye bars. Let us know what you would do with these if you'd change it up at all. Give it a try. Here's the recipe, and y'all have a blessed day.